Python has emerged as a dominant language in the field of machine learning or ML and data science due to its simplicity, versatility, and robust ecosystem of libraries and tools. In this video, we'll explore 15 must-have Python tools for ML and data science, covering a wide range of functionalities essential for data manipulation, analysis, modeling, and visualization. 1. NumPy NumPy is a fundamental package for numerical computing with Python. It provides support for multidimensional arrays and matrices, along with a collection of mathematical functions to operate on these arrays efficiently. NumPy's array operations significantly enhance the performance of numerical computations, making it indispensable for data manipulation and scientific computing in Python. 2. Pandas Pandas is a powerful library for data manipulation and analysis. It offers data structures like data frame and series, which enable easy handling of structured data. With Pandas, users can perform various operations such as data cleaning, transformation, aggregation, and visualization. Its intuitive interface and rich functionality make it a must-have tool for any data science project. 3. Matplotlib Matplotlib is a comprehensive library for creating static, interactive, and animated visualizations in Python. It provides a wide range of plotting functions to visualize data in the form of line plots, scatter plots, histograms, bar charts, and more. Matplotlib's flexibility and customization options make it suitable for generating publication quality figures for data analysis and presentation. 4. Seaborn Seaborn is built on top of Matplotlib and provides a high-level interface for creating attractive and informative statistical graphics. It simplifies the process of generating complex visualizations such as heat maps, pair plots, violin plots, and joint plots. Seaborn's integration with Pandas data structures makes it easy to create visualizations directly from data frame objects, making it an essential tool for exploratory data analysis. 5. Scikit-learn Scikit-learn is a versatile library for machine learning in Python. It provides a simple and efficient interface for implementing various machine learning algorithms, including classification, regression, clustering, dimensionality reduction, and model selection. Scikit-learn also offers tools for pre-processing data, evaluating model performance, and performing cross-validation, making it suitable for both beginners and experienced practitioners. 6. TensorFlow TensorFlow is an open-source machine learning framework developed by Google. It enables building and training ML models, especially neural networks, with ease. TensorFlow provides a flexible computational graph abstraction that allows users to define complex models and execute them efficiently on CPUs, GPUs, or TPUs. With TensorFlow, users can implement a wide range of deep learning architectures and tackle challenging tasks such as image recognition, natural language processing, and reinforcement learning. 7. Keras Keras is a high-level neural networks API written in Python. It provides a user-friendly interface for building and training deep learning models, hiding the complexity of low-level TensorFlow, Theano, or Microsoft Cognitive Toolkit or CNTK implementations. Keras supports both sequential and functional model architectures and enables rapid prototyping of neural networks for various applications. Its simplicity and modularity make it an essential tool for beginners and researchers alike. 8. PyTorch PyTorch is another popular open-source machine learning framework developed by Facebook's AI Research Lab. It offers a dynamic computational graph mechanism that makes it easy to define and train neural networks on the fly. PyTorch's imperative programming style and extensive GPU acceleration support make it suitable for rapid experimentation and research in deep learning. It also provides a rich ecosystem of libraries and tools for building end-to-end -end ML pipelines and deploying models in production. 9. Scrapy Scrapy is a fast, high-level web crawling and web scraping framework written in Python. It allows users to extract structured data from websites and store it in formats like JSON, CSV, or XML. 
Scrapey provides a powerful yet simple API for defining web scraping workflows, handling pagination, and following links recursively. It also supports asynchronous networking and distributed crawling, making it ideal for scraping large-scale websites and building data pipelines for ML and data science projects. 10. NLTK or Natural Language Toolkit NLTK is a leading platform for building Python programs to work with human language data. It provides easy-to-use interfaces to over 50 corpora and lexical resources, including WordNet, which is a large lexical database of English. NLTK offers tools for tokenization, stemming, tagging, parsing, and sentiment analysis, making it indispensable for tasks such as text classification, information retrieval, and machine translation. 11. GenSim GenSim is a Python library for topic modeling, document indexing, and similarity retrieval with large corpora. It offers scalable implementations of popular algorithms like latent semantic analysis or LSA, latent Dirichlet allocation or LDA, and Word2Vec. Gensim's efficient memory usage and support for streaming algorithms make it suitable for processing large text datasets and extracting meaningful insights from unstructured text data. 12. Stats Models Stats Models is a library for statistical modeling and hypothesis testing in Python. It provides a wide range of statistical models, including linear regression, generalized linear models, time series analysis, and survival analysis. Stats Models also offers tools for estimating parameters, conducting hypothesis tests, and visualizing results, making it a valuable tool for empirical research and data-driven decision-making. 13. XGBoost XGBoost is an optimized gradient boosting library designed for efficiency and performance. It provides an implementation of gradient-boosted decision trees, which are powerful machine learning models for classification, regression, and ranking tasks. XGBoost's scalability, speed, and accuracy make it a popular choice for winning solutions in machine learning competitions and real-world applications. 14. LightGBM LightGBM is a gradient-boosting framework developed by Microsoft. It is designed for distributed and efficient training of large-scale datasets with millions of samples and features. LightGBM employs novel techniques such as histogram-based splitting and leaf-wise tree growth to achieve faster training speeds and lower memory usage compared to traditional gradient-boosting implementations. It is widely used for tasks like click-through rate prediction, recommender systems, and anomaly detection in industry settings. 15. Jupyter Notebook Jupyter Notebook is an open-source web application that allows users to create and share documents containing live code, equations, visualizations, and narrative text. It supports multiple programming languages, including Python, R, and Julia, and provides an interactive computing environment for data analysis and exploration. Jupyter Notebook's integration with libraries like Pandas, Matplotlib, and Scikit-Learn makes it an indispensable tool for prototyping ML models, documenting analysis workflows, and collaborating with peers. Conclusion Python offers a rich ecosystem of libraries and tools for machine learning and data science, catering to a wide range of needs and preferences. The 15 must-have Python tools discussed in this article cover essential functionalities such as data manipulation, analysis, modeling, and visualization, empowering users to tackle real-world challenges in ML and data science effectively. Whether you're a beginner exploring the basics of data analysis or an experienced practitioner building complex ML models, these tools provide the necessary building blocks to drive innovation and insights in the field of data-driven decision-making. That's all for this video. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and hit that notification bell for more content. So you don't miss any upcoming video. And, if you have any questions or topics, you'd like us to cover in future videos. Please let us know in the comments below. Until next time, keep exploring and keep coding. Thanks for watching, and happy coding.